Hi. Okay. How's it going? Hope it's going good. All right. This lesson is cello advanced packet number two. So if you notice, the top says lesson five. That's how you know it's the, the advanced packet. It's the one I made. Okay. Um, if you've already completed the first packet, the one that said lesson one, where the first lesson was triplets and then it went to the Irish washerwoman, that's how, if you've done that one, that's how you know you're on this one. This is the next one, okay? All right, so there's a new things, but more fun things that you can now add in, okay? So I shall tell you what they are. All righty, so what you've got here is the new thing, if you look at the book, the packet, whatever, is you've got B, Oh, you've got the flat. It's this guy right here. Looks like that. It's called a flat. It says, lowers a note by one half step. So now you've got the three things that are related are over here. The natural is the note with no sharp or anything, and also now no flat, okay? So, um, like when you learned F on the D string with three fingers, and then you didn't want it sharp. It was just F, F sharp, made it higher, okay? F was your second finger. And if you recall, I was like, if I use the, if I call it like F or if I call it F natural, it's the same note. So the note with nothing is a natural. So you have like B on the G string. That B, that third finger that you've been playing along, that's B, it's also B natural, same idea. Even though it's third finger, it's B natural. So now what you're doing is you're gonna make it into a B flat, which means it's lower by a half step, which means you go down. So the natural's in the middle, and now you're making it flat. So you, if you're going down, it become, the note becomes flat. If you're going up, the note becomes sharp, okay? Then, if you're calling it B flat, this is the note that we skipped way back in the day. When you learned the G string and we skipped second finger, it's because it was B flat. So when you see B with no, uh, with no nothing, that's the B that you know, third finger. And if they want to make you have a B flat, they put a flat in front of it and it becomes second finger. And that's all it is, second finger on the G string, the one we skipped, okie dokie. So then, if you play number one, you're the home free. G, 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 A, 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 B flat, B flat, B flat, because the flat carries. A, 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 G, and that's all it is, second finger on the G string. And that's what the flat means. Um, and also I can just talk to you more about it if you have real questions about the flat. But if you understand what the sharp is doing, the flat just adjusts the opposite, it goes down. All right, I'm gonna play number one. Get ready. I'll get ready, you get ready. Here we go. Okay, I'm making sure you can really see my fingers good. So you're gonna play G, A, and B flat, second finger, okay? Uh, all right, here we go. Piece of, I mean, so easy. Here we go. One, ready, go. <laughs> number two triplets it's an easy thing the open string each time is a d and it's triplets each time and if you notice it's g g g d a a a d b -b 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 d okay so that's the pattern it's a piece of cake probably don't even need my help but here's what it sounds like triple let go <laughs> So you got to make sure you're doing triple at quarter, triple at quarter. Okay. Uh, number three, they're using everything you know now. They're changing to six, eight time. So remember, it'll be one, two, three, four, five, six. And you're slurring three. They're giving it all to you. But if you look and follow the pattern, it's G's and A's and B flats. And yeah, that's it. So, oh, I'm sorry. Is there a C? Yeah. Okay. So here I go. And you can do it slow as long as you're... Do whatever speed works for you as long as you are accurate. Don't just go fast to go fast, okay? 
So here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> Again, make it nice and smooth and even. All right? All right. And then the song of the week will be America the Beautiful. Um, you know the song. I mean, you know the song. It's actually harder to play than you think, which is why it doesn't make it in the book until the book two lesson, packet two, uh, because it's got B flat in it. It has a random F sharp in it. You have to pay attention. It has slurs. Um, but you also have to remember that it only has one random F sharp, so don't play extra sharps for no reason. And there's B flats in it, uh, which are written in. Okay, and the other other one new thing is right here. This word, uh, it's legato. It's Italian. Legato is Italian for smooth. Um, so, you know, the song is a smooth sounding song. So if you notice, they wrote legato down here. All right, so here it is. You start up bow because there's a little pickup, and it's very easy. And if you're doing it right, it really sounds really nice. So check it out. I'll do my best. You should too. One, two, three. <laughs> So there it is. Uh, definitely don't play extra F sharps in there because that sounds yucky. Uh, okay, so that's it. B flat, second finger on the G string because B is third finger. You're going down a half step, going back. Okay, all right, good luck with that. And um, I'll see you very soon and I'll show you another one. You can look ahead in the book and we'll, or look in the packet and we'll move on. Okay, good luck. Bye.